Hey guys, what's up? So when you're running into deadlines and stuff like that, most people say to uh, shut off the um, the updates on the Windows system. Obviously, if you're experienced enough, you gotta let them run. You gotta keep those updates going uh, on your computer uh, because shutting them, people just get in the habit of shutting them off and letting them run off too long, and then your system really starts to run into compatibility errors and vulnerability errors to you know hackers or or um, people that are trying to do bad things with your computer. Uh, in this case, though, after the update, the right monitor uh, on my uh, I have like a, um, a flat screen monitor hooked up as my second display uh, turned into the rainbow glitch effect uh, without getting too technical a lot of times this can just boil down to it being a refresh rate issue so if you again I'm on the second monitor keep in mind if you right click anywhere on the desktop go to Nvidia control panel um, keep in mind too this is displaying um, clearly on the recording right now so when I'm recording this uh, screen it looks clear through the computer but what it's displaying on the actual monitor is that rainbow glitch effect and an easy way to tell the difference too is it to check to make sure it's not just your computer is if you click the settings button on your monitor and the settings control panel looks normal but the monitor looks all glitchy and rainbowy you know it's an issue with something in the display driver and it's not an issue with your actual monitor um, so from here we go to display change resolution we want to click on the second monitor over here. Just to test it here, we'll go to 1080 to 1920p is the simple way I would tell you to do it. Uh, click apply, see what happens, and blam, the colors are back to normal. Uh, and you should be all set to go. Um, click yes to keep the changes. Okay, so now once that's fixed though, we have the issue of the overscan in the corners uh, that happens on a lot of these monitors, uh, and people get annoyed of that. Even people who haven't run this problem don't know how to do this or fix this, but you can't click your Windows button or any of your tabs down here. So what we wanna do from here is we go over to uh, the side panel over here and we go to uh, adjust desktop size and position. We want to go to the second monitor. Uh, mine's already checked. Yours probably isn't. Go to Enable Desktop Resizing. Click Resize. You'll see green arrows in the corner here. And you just want to make sure that when you're resizing it, the corners of those arrows uh, point to the corners of your screens uh, so that you can clearly uh, you know, see the bottom of your screen, the sides of your screen, and uh, properly operate your Windows stuff. All right, that's it for now, guys. Uh, I hope this helped out a lot. Um, and I got to get my clients uh, updates to now ASAP because this was one more thing, as always, to make us late on our deadline. Take care.